Hi, I'm Shia LeVette with ChildCareLand.com and today I want to share with you Play-Doh straw lacing. This is really a great activity for fine motor skills development. All you need to have are straws and Play-Doh. This can be done in one of two ways. Children can just lace the, um, put the balls of Play-Doh on the straw this way or you can make a base, they can make a base and have it stand up and then do it this way. Um, but you just need to have Play-Doh. You can have different colors of Play-Doh if you want and the children would um, roll the play-doh into a ball. You want to make sure you have fresh play-doh and they would just push the straw through the play-doh ball like so and bring it down. Now if they want to make a base they would just push the base or the play-doh down so the straw stands up on there and then they would continue to um, we'll do another one with a different color here and lace it. Now when you punch the straw through the play-doh some of the play-doh is going to stay in the straw and it doesn't really matter but the children if they want you can show them how just to pinch the straw and slide up with it and some of the play-doh will come out not all of it will come out of the straw but some of it will so you can take another color it would hang on to the straw put the play-doh ball on top and push down gently and then slide it down the straw and they would continue until uh, they're Play-Doh straws filled up with Play-Doh balls. Again, just push it down gently. And whatever is extra hanging on the straw, you can just pull up too and take off. And then another color we could do, and if you just want it, they work, if they're beating it this way, it would be the same way. Or lacing it, I should say. Just push the Hold on to the straw, push the Play-Doh on, and slide it all the way down until it meets the next Play-Doh ball that you have on your straw. Um, as an extension activity, after they filled up the whole straw, you could have them count the number of Play-Doh balls that they have placed on the straw, too. So that works well for a math, math activity, to fill up the straw and then count the number, number of Play-Doh balls that you have on the straw. But you can kind of get the idea, they would just fill this up and again you can have this standing as a base and all the extra can be taken out by just pinching the straw and sliding up like that. A really fun activity, great for developing fine motor skills and again, I don't know anybody who doesn't love Play-Doh. So for a Play-Doh straw lacing activity, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com and thanks for watching.